Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Beautiful Joe 2. Last part we left off we were at 10 million years BC. We beat up a few bad guys on the way and nothing will change on this part. That's right, tons and tons of enemies this time around. We're gonna beat the crap out of them like we've done before because that's what Joe and Sylvia do. They're heroes. So yeah, it's what they do best. Had a nice view to fly off that. And that's more food, basically. Your health would increase a little bit more with that. It's a combo meal. <laughs> So yeah, that volcano is a Zerk, so what we have to do is go all the way back to where that rock was placed, which was conveniently on top of a switch, by the way, <laughs> and uppercut it back to the volcano. Yeah, I usually use VFX before the rock hits me so I can get a few V-points out of it. And I got a nice beautiful out of that too, so it all worked well. See, this is where sliding would have been really helpful for me. If I bought sliding, if I bought sliding before I went to this stage, it would have been really helpful. I would have got more beautiful points out of it. Both Joe and Sylvia have that move as well, so you're good either way. You see how the enemy is like far behind me, but I can't get to him. Just running in slow motion. If I let go of the slow motion, the combo stops. I probably would have been able to reach that last enemy if I slid. So. It would have been pretty helpful if I had the sliding technique. Now as I proceed down here, you see a shoot me icon, which you can use Sylvia for. You hold, you press the Y button, sorry. You press the Y button and she's able to shoot. If you press the Y button while in slow motion, you have a bigger currency. So the coins get bigger if you use your slow motion VFX. And they get smaller if you just shoot them normally. So yeah, you pick and choose. <laughs> Also, another thing that I want to point out, right before this volcano interrupted me again, what a jerk. <laughs> so yeah, with this volcano, you just have to hold slow motion while the camera starts shaking, and you'll be good. The rock conveniently hits the switch again, and the bridge opens. Introducing you to a key which you have to receive. Now when you switch, you can hold the Z button. I don't know how effective that move is, but it is an attack. The drawback is your VFX will deplete. I'm pretty sure VFX goes down all the way if you hold it. So I don't know, I'm guessing if you're in a situation where you're about to die, I'm guessing it's a desperation type of move. So it's best to keep note of that. Collect these beautiful icons here, and let's take this key back to its proper place. Just doing this to buy some time for slow motion. Alright, let's uppercut this rock to death. Or back to the volcano. <laughs> Do the same thing as before, and you should be fine. I'm gonna upcut that enemy because he has the key. <laughs> Whoever receives the key deserves multiple damage. And when I'm in a puzzle, see how the fan just went down? When I held the slow motion button, you're gonna get puzzles like that a lot. And I need to go back and get the key. <laughs> that would be helpful. Okay, now here is when you get introduced to this guy. 
um, he's not really hard to beat. It's just when you get to him the first time around, this is going to be pretty complex. So you're going to have to avoid his laser beam. He'll use his laser beams three times, and after that, he'll resort to his gun because I guess guns beat lasers. But anyway, you deflect the bullet that he shoots, and while he's dazed, you use slow motion and beat him up. And in return, you will get a new technique. This is always good. And with the aid of Beautiful Joe, this special is called Lock Speed. You're able to move really fast. And while you're punching, you will have like little images of yourself in various places. When you're on fire, you use Lock Speed to cool yourself off. And then when you punch up this long enough to be on fire, <laughs> you're able to make your enemies flammable as well. That's pretty cool. Here's where you get introduced to another new enemy. Once you use Mach Speed, their balloons will deflate and you beat them up. Simple. If you use slow motion, their balloons will inflate. <laughs> so be careful when you're around them. You might, because you might be in the middle of a slow motion combo and they'll just show up out of nowhere and their balloons will inflate and they'll try and hit you with one of their bombs, so be careful with that. As you see, that one enemy is able to slide, and he has a weapon as well, so be careful. Seems like the volcano never ceases to becoming a jerk, so this is I just cannot stand this part. I really don't like this part. <laughs> so you have to time your jumps. And you can just use that punching bag to set yourself on fire and run through the lava. Whichever you favor. And here's the mini boss again. Just avoid his three of his lasers. It doesn't matter, just use slow motion to dodge it. And he'll resort to the gun again. Just like the bullet. And beat him up. In slow motion, of course. And you're done. So yeah, got a beautiful out of that. Pretty good score. And with that, Street Skate signing out. See you all later.